Michael. You can't do this. I forbid it. Sit tight. I got a lead on the hit woman who framed you. Good. You're gonna ruin everything. Tell Abby not to cop to anything. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Don't you dare go near the jetty docks. You stay away from the jetty docks. Who was that? Was that Johnny? Uh, look, I gotta take care of something. All right. Um, just don't tell anything to anybody. I'll see you later. Right? about the docks when you called i told you to stay put why don't make me sorry that i gave you a heads up you said you had a lead on the shooter what are you, you meeting meet her here Look, i don't know what the hell's going on all right for all i know this could be an ambush setup that my father's going to take me out and try to take over the organization if your father takes you out i'll come after my father next Michael, you need backup anything that could happen here would be a violation of your parole get lost no excuse me Look, if you found the woman who shot brandon we need to catch her she could be abby's only chance we planned, all right? Yeah, okay. Anybody pulls a gun, you call the cops and get lost. Just catch her. We meet again. Give me my money. If my father promised you money, he's probably forgotten he's losing it these days. Well, if you don't have my money, we've got nothing to talk about. Well, tell me why I'm paying you. I mean, what exactly did you do to deserve this? now any deal you made with my father's off the table he doesn't run things i do would you rather pay me what i'm owed or i go to Krinthos. i'm sure he'll be interested in what i have to say you think so huh well his son's girlfriend has a murder charge hanging over her head hmm. Krinthos finds out she was framed won't end well you making threats now consider it a warning if i don't get my money your body will be found in a parking lot next you know, you're not really helping before. My father's a little off his rocker. He spends most of his days talking about his rose bushes. So you can see why I wouldn't be privy to the details of your deal. So all I'm asking is that you enlighten me. What exactly am I paying you for? Half a million for the hit. But my silence is going to cost you more. <laughs> wow, if you think I'm going to pay you that much cabbage for the hit of some low-level punk and to cover it up, you're crazier than my pop. Wrong answer. I drop the gun! Cops, like the law-abiding citizens that we are. Dante, did you talk to the DA? Is he trying to drop the charges? Oh, okay, slow down one step at a time. Okay, Ronnie's in there questioning the suspect right now. What more do you need to know? <laughs> she admitted that she was paid to frame Abby. Record the whole thing on Johnny's cell phone. Okay, if the recording checks out, I'll give it to the DA. But in the meantime, you both have to make statements anyway. Dante, why are you dragging your feet? <laughs> I'm doing my job, Michael. I'm collecting the facts. I'm getting all the evidence together. I thought your job was to protect the innocent. Look, I'm trying to clear Abby's name just like you are, but I have to see that we have a legitimate case here. You think I'm lying? I don't know. He just wants to make sure that I didn't pay that woman to take the fall. That he doesn't want to see a young, innocent kid sent to prison <laughs> again. Yeah. Look, Michael, I know you want Abby free and clear of these charges, but I have to make sure that you don't want it so bad you didn't just hear something you want to hear. She confessed to killing Brandon. Johnny heard the exact same thing. Yeah, what, what, is, what is this, you know? You bring a suspect down to the station and turn her in? Yeah, I want to see justice served. Yeah, but Johnny, you don't, you don't cooperate with the police, ever. Just doing my civic duty, detective. Yeah, I, would, I would believe that if you didn't spend all your time breaking the law like your family. Dante, you hate when people lump you with Dad. Now you're doing the exact same thing to Johnny. Yeah, Michael, that's because I'm not trying to take over the family business like Johnny is. Okay, look, I, I, I could spend all day trying to explain my motives and intentions, but it wouldn't matter. What matters is the facts, right? That's right. The woman confessed to killing Brandon. And if the confession checks out with the facts, then the case is closed and Abby's off the hook. Yeah, thanks to you. I had a hell of an assist. If you have concern... Rise and shine! Nap time's over. What? No pithy comeback about life would be so much easier if my ungrateful son hadn't duct taped me to a chair. 
You didn't go dying on me now, did you? Would you miss me? No. Hmm, <laughs> nice try. But I definitely detected a hint of concern in your voice. Yeah, concern that I wouldn't be able to see you take your last breath. You put up a good front, John. You make a good show out of hating me, but deep down, you've already proven you're too loyal or too soft to ever do away with your own father. Yet. How'd you get the tape off your mouth? An angel paid me a visit. Careful. Talk like that'll get you committed. Michael is a lucky kid. That Abby is one hot piece. Abby was here. Try to keep up, John. Get to the point. That Abby could be useful to us. That is, if she's not put away for murdering her ex. It's not gonna happen. You wouldn't. Come here. Oh. Ah. Ah. Ah, my arm. <laughs> I don't like you doing business behind my back. And I don't like being disrespected, so I guess we're even. Hiring that woman to frame Abby was a mistake. One that you'll regret. Want a bet? She's down at the PCPD now, giving a statement. So? So, she likes to talk a lot about the money that you owe her. It's hearsay. Hearsay. You know, the police do have material evidence that tied you to that murder. So, if it checks out, back to Pentonville you go. Goodbye, garden. Hello, cement. <laughs> what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be out celebrating with your girlfriend? It's not every day you'd be in a murder rap. Well, uh, I wanted to thank you. Glad I could help. Although, <laughs> your brother probably doesn't believe me, huh? No, well, Dante's a cop. I'm pretty sure at the academy they took an oath to not trust anybody. Probably wise. Well, I don't know. Well, if I didn't trust you, Abby, you'd still be charged with killing Brandon. No big deal. Well, look, I know how much you claim to hate Anthony, but it must have been pretty hard to go against your own father. Oh, well, believe me, I, I do hate my father. I have for most of my life. He is still my father, though, at the same time. So as far as shutting him out of my life for good, I don't know if that's going to happen. But I'm not going to stand by and watch while he makes a mess out of innocent people's lives. Now look, in any case, I owe you. After all the trouble my family's put you through, I'd say we're even. Well, look, I, I, I want to repay you. Millie, Johnny, I mean it. Whatever you need. <laughs>